Y'all sick. I've been having to make so many knives. Uh, these are almost done, but this is like a tenth of the knives I'm working on. I literally have knives everywhere. This is all one piece from tang to tip, which is so cool. Uh, thanks to this gigantic beast right here and some pretty slick 3D printing technique. Uh, these guys, the same thing. Once uh, they need to be sanded down and everything, they'll turn into my pros where I hand paint the handles and everything. It's all one piece, thanks to this beauty right here. Uh, cool stuff. I've actually uh, switched to a new gloss and it's a little brighter and a little thicker and a little shinier and uh, it looks really cool. Uh, I'm digging it. All right, so here we go. I'm going to turn these into wood grain, starting with a base coat of brown, following by uh, a light tan and a different shade of brown. And here is the next step. I'm adding the grain look, and this will dry, and then I will gloss it. And even though it looks glossy right now, it doesn't look the same as actual gloss. So once this is dried and glossed, uh, it really takes on that wood look, and uh, very cool. So here we go, getting started on the chroming. And what's interesting is you don't get that full chrome effect until after it's had some cure time, because I actually have to buffer it with, um, microfiber cloth and after I buff it some not buffer but buff it some microfiber cloth then it looks real nice and uh, this is just some painters tape I have to go ahead and wrap it in some medical tape after because that's how they have it in the movie so uh, that's a good start and next up I gotta do that uh, some chroming to these guys and then prime him and start on my handles so good stuff see you guys later Take two, so much better. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I just have to clean it up, and obviously this is straight off the machine. I have to remove uh, the brim and the supports and uh, clean up a bit, and then work on the marks here. I'm thinking of doing a gold, uh, like a silk gold, so it'll be really shiny. Uh, and this is carbon fiber, so super strong. Uh, very exciting. Good morning, friends. Holy cow. Want some shipping labels? So it is Saturday morning, and I have over 40 orders in my queue. Shout out to Crowley Zora. That was her Halloween hook. And I'm doing everything in my power to make this stuff, because everybody wants it for Halloween. Everybody, everybody. But a lot of my stuff... Requires hand painting and airbrushing. Y'all know that. Y'all in my inbox like, oh, please, oh, please, Halloween. Don't worry not to worry. Seven days a week, Monday to Friday, Saturday to Sunday, a.m. to p.m., airbrushing, painting, printing, strapping, meshing, gluing, you name it, I'll be doing it. So no worries, guys. I got you all covered. I'll be doing my absolute very best.